do you do you use line oh yes I actually use it every day with to chat with my friends and family it's um, very convenient well one reason is these let me show you um, <coughs> over here these little pictures they're called stamps and they used to communicate your emotions or feelings which sometimes can be difficult to do in just words mm -hmm. so you have lots and lots of pictures and all you do is just press on one and you can send it <laughs> it's very simple i use them a lot too and there are so many different types there certainly are and uh, currently uh, they have more than 10,000 types of stamps and the company says users worldwide send an average of 7.2 billion messages and stamps uh, in a day which is about 22 per user. That's a lot of data traveling around. It, it certainly is and this time we have a report on new businesses that are being born from these stamps so take a look. The 1,300-year-old Kanda Myojin Shrine. It is devoted to the god of business. Last year was the 400th anniversary of its relocation from Otemachi to Kanda. To mark the occasion, the shrine tried something new. Shrines have the perception of being old. We don't get a lot of young people, especially young men. And line is something most young people do. Late last year, the shrine began selling digital illustrations called stamps, used on the messaging application Line. The main theme of their stamps is good fortune, whether in business or romantic relationships. The pop culture-inspired designs are in stark contrast to the shrine's 1,300-year history. One set includes 40 types of stamps and costs 100 yen, or less than a dollar. The shrine's aim is to use this to draw in young people. Even our shrine maidens say the characters are cute and might be effective. Such line stamps are a big business now. In May last year, the company launched the Line Creators Market, where regular users can make and sell their own stamps. Creators are required to make a set containing 40 different stamps and earn half of every 100 yen in sales. In the first six months, total sales reached 3.6 billion yen with submissions by 270,000 creators. This is a stamp award ceremony held in November last year. I'd like to say thank you to everyone who became fans of my stamps. A student took the grand prize. The stamps she came up with depict people speaking in a Kansai dialect and were ranked first in monthly sales. A stamp designed by a first grader and her father won a special judge's prize. The top 10 stamps brought in average sales of 36.8 million yen. We never expected it to be this big as a business. It takes us several months to evaluate submissions. One person who succeeded in doing just that is office worker Tatsuki Yoshinaga. He works at a group company of communications provider NTT. At his condo in Tokyo one weekend, with pencil in hand, he starts drawing something. This is A4 copier paper that costs 100 yen for 100 pages. I draw on them using a pencil. At university, I was in the sciences, so I never studied how to draw, as you can see. 
This is Mr. Yoshinaga's illustration. With a smartphone, he scans it and cleans it up on his computer. His line stamp is finished. The stamps depict a character he designed with Egypt as the theme. He says it comes from something he used to doodle as a student. Surprisingly, this lethargic looking character became a hit with young women and over a six month period, sales reached about 5 million yen. They began accepting stamps from anybody, so I submitted mine as a joke, and it just caught fire. He earned 5 million yen, or more than $40,000, in just half a year. Later, he notified his company about his side job. The employment rules allow for side incomes if you get permission, so I'm officially allowed to do this. Hi. I wouldn't have done it. I never imagined this. Line stamp creators have spread to 145 countries and regions. The company's strategy? There are still many regions overseas where we have to strategically grow users. We want people to associate line with stamps and get users abroad to use these as well. Line stamps offer a wide range of people the opportunity to make extra cash with simple drawings. That market may be expanding across the globe.